Hello again from my front porch, where it is a rather blustery day here in Iowa. Uh, had a little storm that blew through a little while ago, and I say little because it got really dark. It got windy. A rain came down, but it only lasted like ten minutes. Uh, you know that that old there's that old adage that you know here in the Midwest and here in Iowa uh, that if you don't like the weather, wait ten minutes and it'll change. Well, that's exactly what happened. And in fact, over the last week or so we've had 40 degrees we've had 70 degrees we've had rain we've had wind um some parts of iowa over the weekend had predictions of snow uh, i don't know if they got it i didn't pay that much attention i try to avoid that topic as much as possible um but uh, I, I see now that the, the, the winds have, con the, have continued to blow. Even after that storm got done, the winds have continued to blow strong. Uh, I could hear it all the way down in the basement here at my house. Uh, and uh, now, as, as I'm out here, I see, oh, look, the sky. The, it was sunny, uh, sunny through the clouds, overcast. But now it's getting darker again. And so I'm thinking, oh, maybe there's another little storm. <laughs> about to, must be what's going to happen today. Little, little, little isolated pockets of thunderstorms just sort of mm, blew, blow through. <clears throat> Excuse me. But what I wanted to chat with you about is, you know, we are now in the fall season. And uh, so I, I get to wear my favorite color scheme. I, I used, uh, I, I love browns and grays and reds and you know, greens and, you know, those kind of fall type colors. Uh, and I used to wear them all the time. Uh, then it was pointed out to me that that was predominantly what my entire wardrobe was. <laughs> and so I thought, okay, well, so I need to expand my color scheme. Uh, now Lisa's daughter, Sophia, points out that uh, I may have expanded my color scheme, but I, I still also have a whole lot of plaid <laughs> and checkered. <laughs> and so when I talk about the need to go buy some new shirts, she's always like, <clears throat> No plaid, no plaid. <laughs> um, so no, no plaid today, but it is it is it is from my brown uh, fall color scheme, uh, and so yay, there's that. But speaking of being ready and looking good for fall, I wanted to share with you that I have added some things to the front porch for the fall season. See, I got these pillows. This one says, "Happy fall, y'all." And this one says, welcome fall. <laughs> now, the reason I'm pointing these out is because I've always had pillows here on the porch. Now, for a long time, like years, I just had a couple of brown throw pillows out here. Now they started a lot darker brown than what they look like at the end. <laughs> but uh, I replaced them here this last year with a couple of white pillows that I found that had black writing on them about the front porch and welcoming to the front porch. Uh, and I thought, oh, well, those, I need those on the front porch. Just like, you know, this little sign, you know, that I added up here. And so uh, for a while now, those have been the, the pillows. Well, Lisa and I were shopping in the post Halloween bargain shopping. You know, that's, that's when everything gets reduced in price 50 or even 20 or even 75%. And, um, uh, and so then the price of everything is actually what it should have been in the first place. <laughs> But we're picking through some of the some of the stuff there, and there was this bin that had Halloween themed pillows, and uh, Lisa said, "Oh, here they, these pillows. These are really cool. You should have had these on your front porch dur during October." I was like, "Well, I, I, well, I didn't, and plus, I don't do uh, seasonally themed pillows. That's 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 just silly. That's who who would do something like that?" Uh, and. So, and so we were digging through stuff, but then, you know, I was looking back at those pillows and I was like, hmm, okay, so you know, now these are not them. These, these are not those pillows. But I was looking at the pillows and I was thinking, hmm, maybe it wouldn't be such a bad idea. Maybe, maybe yeah, they are kind of cool. Okay, so I bought them. That was the mistake. You see, that was, that was the moment when everything changed. Because I get home with these two pillows that I can't use because Halloween's done, which means I'm gonna have to store them for an entire year before I can pull them out and use them. I have, at that point, just bought seasonally themed pillows that I am going to store just so I can bring out in a year to display. <laughs> now, I can try to justify this by saying, well, but it's set pieces. For this show, it's you know it's for the front porch, just like these are now. 
But the reason I have these now is because <laughs> buying those two Halloween pillows opened the floodgate. That was the popping of the cork. That was the, oh, hey, now that I have these seasonally themed pillows, next time I'm in the store, these pop out at me. Oh, look, fall themed pillows. Well, those would work right now. Ta-da, here they are. They came home with me. And now I know that means I am going to be having an eye out for, okay, what are going to be the other seasonally themed pillows now <laughs> that I'm going to have to put out here on the front porch? You're going to have to keep watching <laughs> and see when they come up. <clears throat> I'm going to have to go buy a tub <laughs> to store all these pillows in. And I'm just like, when did I become a guy who buys seasonally themed pillows? <laughs> I mean, you know, there's uh, commercials on TV that that doctor helping is helping people who turn into their parents. Even my parents don't buy seasonally themed pillows. <laughs> and it's not like it's not like Lisa, Lisa and I don't live together. There's nobody else living here with me. There's no there's no female person that's going, hey, you know, these pillows would look nice. We should get these. Pillows. No, no, no. It is just me. I am the only one living here in this house and I bought seasonally themed pillows and I will buy more. <laughs> I don't know when this, I don't know how, well, I know when this happened. It happened when I was, when I, when I was uh, uh, convinced, I shouldn't even say convinced. I don't want to make it sound like Lisa didn't strong arm me. She didn't, she, she simply mentioned that that would be a thing. And I, I dismissed it. I poo pooed it. But then as we stood there, I kept looking over the pillows and, and, and I convinced myself this was a good idea. <laughs> Why? Why? <laughs> oh, look, the sky's brightening up again. So it's starting to brighten up that way. And so that means the dark clouds are passing over and we didn't get any rain this time. Okay, well, uh, I guess today is going to be a guessing game weather-wise here in Iowa. Um, but that's okay. Um, yeah, I, I, I'm, I'm just, I'm fine here on the front porch with my seasonally themed pillows. <laughs> just... Just watching the day go by. Okay, that's not true. I actually have work to do. I have to get back. <laughs> I said I heard the storm from down the basement where I was working. So, uh, so I, I do have to go back to that. All right. So with that, I, 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 will, I will let you go. You'll see more. Uh, and we'll talk more about my pillows. Oh, I should also mention these pillows, these particular ones, um, they have good and bad because they're really slick. Can you hear that? You know, that material and and uh, so so that means you know they're they're not like plush comfies they are very squishy but they're squishy because down inside it, they literally just have the fake stuffing stuff in it they're they're not even in a in a container or a, you know some kind of zippered thing inside it's just so if I ever need to wash them I got to pull all the guts out and uh, and then then stop restuff them <laughs> afterwards <laughs> uh, I, I also hate tags on my pillows I, I, I uh, like most people do I assume um, and these guys uh, the, these these were especially nasty because uh, see where's the tag part on this one this was the one I tried to cut the tag off first you can kind of see you can kind of see there where I, where, I, where I cut the tag not, not that part that's part of the pillow but where you see I cut the tag I tried to cut it really close I, I wish they made them so you could just rip them right off, but, uh, but they don't do that. And so I cut really close and you won't be able to see, but I, 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 I nicked the green trim there I, with the scissors. I was cutting along and cut off a little, a little bit of that. And I was like, ah, no, I don't want to do that. But, but they, they, that was, that was tough. And so then I got, I got, uh, I got scissor shy on the, on the, on the, on the, the orange pillow. Um, when it came time to trim this one, there is a lot more of the white <laughs> still left on this pillow because I was like, ah, I, I don't want to cut the edge. I don't want to. And so, so uh, uh, they caused me that challenge. So, but, but, you know, I, I, I'm a newbie, you know, this, these are my first, these are my first displayed. See, I haven't prepped the, the, the October ones yet. They still even have the tags on them and price tags and stuff. Cause I wasn't using them yet. These are the first ones that have been prepped and put out. And so, you know, I'm, I, I, I'm, I'm new at the pillow prep thing. I'm sure I will improve. <laughs> oh, Lord, what am I saying? <laughs> all right, with that, I'm going to let you go, and I'll see you all next time from my front porch.